If you guys are looking for the absolute cheapest coins on the internet right now, head on over to my sponsor, AO. EAH.com. They got the cheapest coins on the market. You can get a million for under 50 bucks. Save that money. Make sure to always use code Poodle at checkout to get your additional 3% off. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today we have the most viewed promo. It is officially live. It's about an hour late. I mean, that is just so typical. I kind of expected this. Like high key, low key, but really high key. Uh, for most feared also went out late last year. If you guys don't remember, I remember this. I remember this very uh, vividly too. I remember I was like, it was like 11:30. I'm waiting for the game. Most feared. I remember me and Zerk were talking. He was like, I'm just gonna wait for it. I'm like, I'm not waiting all day for this. Like, I'm not gonna ruin my entire day for this. So, I actually left. I went to school. I got out around 2:30. It still wasn't out. Like, because I, I told him, I was like, I know this thing isn't gonna come out. I know how this goes. It's not gonna be an hour late. I then went to the mall. I then went shopping for something. And by the time it was five o'clock, I'm going out to dinner. And I remember him texting me saying, like, forget it, the promo. It's not coming out today. Like, it's I'm, I'm done waiting. End up coming out the next day. Like, this is the stuff that I've already come to expect with things like the most feared promo. So, I kind of saw this happening again because that's just kind of something that happens, right? But here we are, an hour late. I feel bad for all you guys who had school, work, lunch break, and now you can't go ahead and participate until later or tomorrow. I truly do. I know I know, messing up the day and your timing of your day always sucks. But let's get into the video. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn that notification bell. Give this video a big thumbs up, and if you guys do need coins for the most feared promo, head on down below to my sponsor. Some of the cheapest coins on the internet, if not the cheapest with my code. Make sure to check it out, pick up some coins. But, missions. Let's go on over. Let's find it. I don't see that up yet, but the challenges are probably up at this point, which the challenges are going to be super important, guys. There's like 8 to 10 free end cap players that you can go ahead and get from this. So, if you guys can see here, milestones, you get the 90 overall end cap right there. And that's the scary ski, uh, scary speed, monstrous m might, and towering terror. These are gonna be the solos that do go ahead and actually get you your, uh, the speed boost, the uh, strength boost, and the height boost. These are gonna be the strategy cards you can use. So remember, if you do the speed one, you lose height. If you do the might and towering, they just give you uh, some height and some strength, or some strength and some height. Like the, the terrors and mites don't actually take away anything. The speed one, because it's so overpowered with 10 plus speed, you or whatever it is, you do go ahead and get like a minus five on height, which isn't the end of the world, honestly. Like. My running back's four foot eight versus you know being five foot six or whatever it ends up being. I'm cool with it, honestly. It is what it is. So that's going to be that one, guys. Remember, there is going to be much more than that. There's going to be a lot more solos as they do get released and stuff, and a lot more end cats. So that's going to be the end cat hero through that solo uh, specifically. And then if we go over to sets, you guys take a look at what is actually out in the game. We can see what is live here. Go to most feared, uh, release one. And you guys can go ahead and see what we're dealing with for the remember there's release one two and three so we have ed reed here larry allen jesse bates the third derrick henry leighton vander s shaq mason jonathan allen Corey davis xavier Rhodes, jeremy chin Derek carr stefan to it now i will be ranking these in my second video today if you guys want to see that uh, let me down below i'm gonna be ranking them so you guys know the best end cap player to actually choose for your team uh depth wise coin wise usefulness wise now, top of the top tier players, guys, these are all good players, honestly. Henry, Jesse Bates, Larry Allen, and Ed Reed are all usable. Now, don't forget, if you do go ahead and put uh, Ed Reed into a uh, safety power-up spot, he will go ahead and actually get a increase on the safety card, so that is good as well. So, make sure to take advantage of that if you do have him. And then, of course, Derek Henry's King Henry's a beast. Larry Allen's a guard, and then Bates is a safety. I mean, again, Bates is going to be tough because there's just so many good safeties. Larry Allen's just going to be an expensive guard, but he will be the best one probably. So, that is something to take advantage of, you know. Here are the exchange sets very typical stuff 81 pluses 81 83 85 87 nothing too crazy there i mean the sets themselves aren't exactly what you're here for this is one of those grinded out promos you know house rules solos uh you know collecting players buying players all that so the missions tab is still not live here is are the packs out in terms of that so i can show you guys what we're working with with those so here we go we got the 81 overall step one of four so this is like you know every promo there's like that limited pack that's like super cheap and affordable for everyone that's kind of this so here you go, your choice of one player from 481 overall most feared players. Overall, you get one player from 481 plus overall players. It's actually not bad. So you pay you pay about $1.80, $1.50 for this. The way I see it is you can get 481s, it's very possible, but it's only $1.80, so it's not horrible. But you could get like an 85, an 87, a 90, 92, right? It's possible. You can even get the 93 LTDs. This isn't that bad. Uh 87 pluses are 25%, right? So that's not bad. That's a really good, there's a really good odds for a $2, you know, $1.80 pack. I actually don't mind that pack at all. It's a pretty good pack. Then you got the four times most feared bundle, 89%, it's 3.4%, nothing too crazy there. You got the most feared pack. Now, what are these packs? It's just regular, regular basics packs. Okay, there's not like, there's not fantasy or anything. So here's the most feared. We got the 20 times most feared bundle. So you get 20 players and a 90 overall, 290 overall, 
toppers now the point of the 90 overall toppers guys as per usual is that you do go ahead and you can go complete the sets right like you get the two for the set and then you get the 20 packs which you should get enough stuff to actually make another player and that's pretty much it then there's the rerolls at 78 plus is 425 that's actually very expensive it's very expensive you literally have to pull like an 87 80 what is it like an 85 86 87 plus just to even come close to retaining value if not making something that's crazy and the 90 overalls are 5500 right there so i mean i don't know i mean you, you could make a lot but i mean i guess you could make a lot but i don't know i don't i don't like it i feel like that's very expensive overall in my opinion um but moving on from there that's that I, I would recommend you open up that pumpkin pack step one of four is what's what's curious to me i wonder if that means that there's gonna be three more like these or four total i should say but that's not bad are the missions tab live yet i mean we're still waiting on these uh are the other solos live god ea is off their stuff today guys i mean no they're usually off their stuff ea is just they're more off their stuff today if that makes sense the word of the day incompetence once again head-to-head -head season let's see if the house rules are live i mean i'd imagine i'd imagine oh there we go out of options get spooky with haunted house rules get as many wins as possible and earn your choice of an end cat 90 overall guys another 90 overall end cat or an 85 plus overall auctionable tradable most feared player play cooldown for five plays so if you use a play you have to wait five more plays to actually go ahead and use it and plays can only be used twice throughout the entirety of a game so if you run this specific quick slants play you have to wait five plays to use it again and then if you run it again you're done for the game now what's interesting about this one is if you click into it here right i is i don't see anything specific so it's just play cooldowns and plays can only be used twice i don't really like that i like the cool ones that end quickly and stuff because you do need a decent amount of wins to actually go ahead and get your stuff but remember guys it's like it's like 15 or 20 wins for the end cat 90 overall so keep that in mind you know it, it's cool and all another end cap but there's a lot guys there's a lot of overall like total end cap players you can actually go ahead and get from this promo and don't forget guys you can go ahead and get another one from the yard which i'm going to go show you guys now so you guys don't miss out on that get it over to the yard uh they've been doing this with every any promo so if you've been around this year enough you probably already know of this give or take right so you're gonna come to the yard and if you go ahead and uh, equip the halloween helmet you can go ahead and actually collect the free end cap player the only thing with this is you have to buy it you have to buy the helmet so i'm assuming it's actually in the store so let's go check that out you have to buy the helmet before you can equip it obviously so that does mean that it's gonna cost some money it also could cost cred i'm gonna see right here most feared objective pass right the most feared stuff is the stuff you're going to need now i believe all you need is the helmet there's a lot of stuff here assuming it's gotta be one of these the most feared ones so there's a helmet in all of these right the most feared helmet so the cheapest one's going to be 2800 for these ones right now these are the deluxe bundles right the cheapest one's going to be the most feared objective pass so i think gets you everything now the thing is so it's either 10 bucks guys or 50,000 cred so if you have the cred which i'm actually kind of short which i'd recommend you get the cred instead because you can get it for free if you play uh if you get it like 400 passing yards five receiving touchdowns you know there's an objective list that you will see that they did post yesterday you will be able to go ahead if you wore that helmet while you do it you will get another ncat 90 overall player so go ahead and do that um you can check out my video from yesterday so you can go ahead and see the entire sheet i had it all up there but that's cool i mean if you play the yard if you ever play the yard for whatever reason or you just want to stack up on all your free players and you know juice your team up that's cool as well i, I have not i have not, nothing against people who do that and you know farm out all the this is what you're supposed to do right farm out all those players i'm really annoyed that i'm not seeing the other solos here yet those are most weird welcome packs so i mean thankfully at least we got that i mean it's just getting it's it's coming it's coming that's some really cool animation right there 83 overall ed reed you know you guys know the deal with this already the old diverse of terror that actually is the solos that i was referring to that i was looking for but that's pretty cool so we got that let's go check out the auction block so we got the most fear uh we got the objective list now so that's pretty cool as well so you guys see your monster morph complete these you can go ahead and earn the end cap players and then of course you can see here some of the top 92 overall players now what i do want to show you guys here real quick there is going to be an objective list as well you guys to go ahead and complete to actually get some most fear players so if you do this guys you get two 90 overall most feared fantasy packs so you get 290 overall two more 90 overall 90 overall players right you get 58,000 xp and 35,000 coins you must get this done before november 4th if not you do lose it and it's one of three auctionable 90 overall players so you don't get to pick any of them but you do get a choice of three and then after you do it again so if you complete 13 objectives you get your first one when you complete 20 you get the second one so that's really cool as well and of course the objectives are very you know it's the very simple stuff i mean just get stars play things do things we, we you guys know the deal already but so you have to play all the most fear challenges and guys make sure you get max stars so you need 360 stars which means there's a high likelihood 
that you have to do them all. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, you got to do them all. And you got to do them all. So make sure you get your max stars. If not, you probably can't complete it. So that's that. Let's go check out the auction block from the players that are alive, as well as seeing if the solos are officially up. The Ultiverse of Terror. I mean, some of them are up. So I mean, it's not like they're not entirely there. But the Ultiverse of Terror is another thing that I do want to go check out. I'm still not seeing it. I wonder why. Um, let's go check out the auction block. Let's see if something. We have some LTDs. Remember, we have the Travis Kelsey. Uh, Travis Kelsey and... I'm blanking. I am blanking. But we have some LTDs to check out. So I do want to check these out. I do want to see what's live. It's, it's, a little, it's a little laggy right now. So you can tell things are really going into the game right now. Let's filter out by Most Feared. Let's see what we're dealing with, guys. We have a ton of stuff. I mean, that's just a lot. We have Larry Allen, Derek Henry. So they're already at the 250, 270 range. They will probably get even a bit cheaper. Well, they, depending on the set, they'll probably go up at first and they'll come back down. You guys know how this goes. So we have the Ed Reed outside linebacker right there. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And I remember, guys, if we do put him into the uh, power for safety card, you can actually get it up in overall. The Travis Kelsey and the JJ Watt. Okay, so Travis Kelsey is actually live. I do want to take a good look at this card art. Um, it looks pretty good. 87 speed, 78 strength, 92 catching, 90 catch in traffic, 91 spec, 93 short, 91 medium, 75 run block. After the catch, uh, he gets 90 jumping. He has, let's see, 85 juke, 87 step farm. He's not bad. I mean, again, I don't think I would. I don't think he's worth the LTD price tag because of his speed, but he's good, right? Like he's like if you happen to get him like NAT for whatever reason, right? Let's just say like I wouldn't have mind having him. If you have him on a Chiefs team, I wouldn't mind having him. I just don't know if I'd pay the price. Is what I'm trying to say here. Next we have JJ Watt for the Cardinals. Really, these are some really cool card art. They're kind of they're animated too, which I really like. They're like a GIF kind of. I think that's really cool. Um, 76 speed, 84 excel. Kind of slow. He looks like Aaron Donald athleticism wise. He then has 93 strength, 90 tackle, 93 play rec, 91 block shed, 93 power move, 87 finesse move. He's going to be power move, block shed, play rec, tackle is always good. He has 87 jumping because he, of course, and he probably is good catching, 76 catching. You guys pop him out into a spire zone. He's actually going to be pretty decent in that spot. He has 90 hit power. He's not a bad card. Overall, they're pretty good, these LTDs. I wouldn't say they're meta, either one of them, but they're not bad. 243, so Bates is coming down here. I wonder why Bates is dropping first. Is he the worst of the bunch? No, 90, no, he's good, actually. He has the 90, 94 zone. 89 man, 93 speed, 6 foot 1. He's actually really good. Decent hit power, 75 catching. These cards are good. I mean, the 92s and above are all good, I would say. Larry Allen's coming down pretty fast. These cards are going to be pretty affordable. I mean, if you see one in, like, the 180 range, I recommend you just hop on it. I mean, the likelihood of them staying there probably isn't too high. They're going to start dropping rapidly with everyone sitting here waiting for the game. And then eventually, they should, like, settle out around a price. Now, I've always been on the mindset. Like, right now, you see a 230 Larry Allen. I, would, I wouldn't necessarily say buy because you see it and like in like 10 minutes, the price settles down to like 190 or it comes back up. But I always I always end up on the wrong end of those things. You know, you got to be careful with that stuff. You never want to be on the wrong end of that stuff. And then, of course, there's the 90 overall end cap player. Well, the ones you can't get end cat. So you guys know the deal. We went over those stats too many times. My ranking video will be coming out sometime today for you guys to so go ahead and check that out. So make sure you do you do, do so. So that's that. Those are the 90 overall players. You guys can see them. I mean, like I said, they're nothing too special. You guys already know about them. The house rules are already live, so that's good. You know, get the most of your challenges. Now, what would I recommend, guys? You got to start doing a bunch of this stuff. There is so much, so much stuff that there is to be done right now. So, I mean, again, the solo challenges will be out at some point, so make sure you check that out. You have house rules to start grinding. You have the yard to be grinding and the solos to be grinding. You want to get, guys, there's like, there's like 8 to 10, anywhere between end cat total players. Again, you can go count them up. I have counted them, but again, some of them, like, kind of double up. I'm not sure if you get them twice or you don't get them right. I would say around, I would say about nine. If you, you want to get all these nine players, because again, even if you put them as backups, it increases your overall. It makes your team better. Uh, you can always quick sell them for like a quarter training if you really need to. But they're pretty good guys. But that's about it for the video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn that on, bell, boys. I'll see you guys back for release two and three as well as some videos in between. But yeah, that's it. Enjoy the rest of your day. If you need coins, head on down below. I'm out. Peace.